Snap, set, kick, dead. Turn to hold, suck up to attempt, 54 yards. Snap, set, kick on the way. Good! You always wonder things about the kicker and what goes through your mind. Here's something that I wonder as we move into December. Do you watch the weather? Every day. <laughs> Do you really? Are you like a Weather Channel, uh, Jim Cantore's my man kind of guy? Yeah, well, see, I've got Brett Kern. You know, Brett's got like five or six weather apps. Does he really? That he like pays subscription to. So he, I mean, he's got like, it's way more in depth than just going to the Weather Channel app. I mean, he's got, he knows everything. He's talking about the fronts, what, you know, what the wind's going to be doing, humidity. I mean, he's got it all down. So I just, so I just he's a weather Brett. nerd. Oh, yeah, he is. I think he wanted to be a meteorologist before he uh, realized he could punt a football really well. All right, so wind is a big factor. Is sleet the biggest fear? Yeah, I've played a couple games in snow and sleet. Uh, that's that's tough, but I mean, you know, it's one of those things like it's, you just kind of, everybody's playing in it, so you know that the, the other kicker's doing it. He's got the same conditions, and you just try to prepare the best you can and, and go out and, and deal with it. Talk to me about your progress through the last two or three years. As your numbers continue to get better, where do you refine what you're doing? Yeah, you know, I really enjoy uh, just trying to find ways to get a little bit better. And that's something I've kind of enjoyed throughout my career. And it's amazing. I'm in my 10th year now, and I feel like I'm learning something new every year. By no means do I have it all figured out. I really love that process. I love trying to find ways to get better, whether it's physically with my body, whether it's technique-wise and kicking, whatever it may be. I just enjoy that. So I'm always sort of looking at different things and trying to find ways to improve. Can you get too deep into that? Yeah, I think so. I, you know, I think there's definitely a balance. You know, I think one of the things that I like to do on game day is really keep it simple. You know, I'll, I'll try to think about having one thought out there, focus on doing one thing when I'm kicking. If I'm trying to think about two or three different things, then uh, usually that, that doesn't go well. So uh, I just try to focus on doing one thing well, what, whatever I'm working on that week. Just go out there and, and just kind of trust my body, trust the instincts to, to go out there and, and let it go. When you go in for a big kick, how do you block everything out? Or do you block everything out? Yeah, well, you know, it's interesting. I think that really all, whether it's a kick in the first quarter or a kick in the fourth quarter, you know, they're all big kicks. Most of the games in this league are decided by, you know, seven points or less. And so really they're all big. And so I think, you know, I just try to go out there and, and just kind of focus. You know, I always say a little prayer to, for peace and just be able to go out there and focus and block everything else out and uh, just try to do what I can, what I can do. Your career long is 54. You matched it this year in Buffalo. Great kick, by the way. That was one of the best ones I've ever seen you hit. Uh, thanks. So when I'm doing Titans radio, what should I say your maximum range is? You know, that's a good question. It really, it depends on the week. See, you that know, doesn't what, help me at all. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry, Mike. You know, it, it really depends what what the field conditions are, what the wind's doing. I mean, I've you know I've gone well back over 60 in practice plenty of times, but it like I said, it just depends on on the condition.